Makar Sankrani, Significance of the Festival As per the Vedic era what is Makar Sankrani and why is it celebrated? In the Vedas, Sankrani deciphers the movement of the sun from one Rashi, constellation of the zodiac, to the next. Hence, there are twelve Sankrantis in a year. Out of these, the Makar Sankrani also dubbed Push Sankrani is considered the most auspicious and it is one of the few Hindu festivals that is aligned with the solar cycle. Makar Sankrani importance isn't just limited to its religious significance. In fact, the festival also marks the beginning of the harvest season when new crops are worshipped and shared with delight. It heralds a change in season, as from this day the sun begins its movement from Dakshinayana, south, to Uttarayana, north, hemisphere, marking the official end of winters. Both a religious occasion and a seasonal observance, the occasion also marks the sun's transit into Makar Rashi, the Capricorn zodiac sign. Traditional connotation and significance of Makar Sankrani as per Ayurveda according to Hindu scriptures, on the day of Makar Sankrani, Lord Vishnu defeated the terror wreaked by demons by severing their heads and burying them under a mountain, symbolizing the end of negativities whilst giving way to righteousness and good intentions to live well and prosper. Therefore, this day is very conducive for sadhana the spiritual practice or meditation as the environment is full of Chaitanya meaning cosmic intelligence and apas. The morning ritual in the ancient scriptures, it is suggested that one should wake up just before sunrise and take a bath on the day of Makar Sankrani, for a positive and auspicious start to the day. It is also recommended to mix a small amount of till or sesame seeds into your bathing water. After bathing, one must offer prayers to the sun by chanting the Gayatri mantra and doing Argya offering water to the sun, which God is worshipped on Makar Sankrani. While there are plenty of stories about Makar Sankrani and its religious roots, it is said that the sun stands for Pratyaksha Brahm, a manifestation of the Absolute, bestowing knowledge, spiritual light, and wisdom, and hence Makar Sankrani is a special festival across the country, where Surya the Sun God is worshipped and offered gratitude and prayers. Festive Rituals What do we do on Makar Sankrani? Makar Sankrani is a time to consume freshly harvested food grains, which are first offered to the gods and then eaten. Ayurveda suggests eating kichdi since it is a light and easily digestible dish. The connotation of eating kichdi is that it prompts the body to prepare for the change in season, from the cold winter breeze to the forthcoming warmth of spring. As the temperature fluctuates from dry cool to surprisingly warm, the body consequentially becomes susceptible to imbalances. Kichdi thus makes for the perfect dish to quench the appetite whilst providing the body with essential nutrition. Apart from its benefits for your health, cooking and eating kichdi on Makar Sankrani is symbolic of unity, since the dish is cooked in a single pot by uniting all the ingredients including freshly harvested rice, lentils, seasonal vegetables, and spices, together. It signifies the process of life and regeneration, which further indicates the beginning of the new harvest year. Ayurveda also suggests taking sesame seeds and jaggery on this divine day. Sankrani and Til, sesame, are synonymous as the festival is also commonly known as Til Sankrani and Apas. Sesame seeds have the ability to absorb negativity and improve the sattva, purity, goodness, and harmony, which in turn facilitate spiritual practice. Kite flying on Makar Sankrani One of the most common attractions of Push Sankrani especially in the Gujarat region is kite flying. The sound of Kai Po Che against the lip-smacking sweets laid out on the terrace is almost an involuntary visual that comes to mind when thinking of Makar Sankrani. It is also believed that the kite flying ritual came into play as a practice of good health. The idea was to expose oneself to the first light of the early morning forthcoming summer sun and douse in the goodness of vitamin D. The Forest Essentials family wishes you a very happy Makar Sankrani. On this auspicious occasion take a moment to ponder over the past, wash off the negativity, and pave the way for a new light to enter your life.